Hey guys, it's Jackson Fulcher, and some really big movie news came out yesterday that, uh, is kind of shocking. Like, really shocking. We all know that Disney owns Lucasfilms, right? We know that, because they're making a Star Wars movie, right? Well, apparently, they're in the works of an Indiana Jones reboot. And who have they announced to be eyed for that? Mr. Chris Pratt, Star-Lord Emmett from the Lego movie. He's been in a lot of stuff. He's going to be in Jurassic World later this year. He's in a lot of stuff. And to be honest, I think that's really good casting. I can actually see Chris Pratt as Indiana Jones. He has that kind of like ability to him that the Raiders of the Lost Ark Indiana Jones had, which was pretty cool. So Chris Pratt is Indiana Jones. I like that. Then again, this is an Indiana Jones reboot. Reboot. Why does Indiana Jones need to be rebooted? Indiana Jones movies are great, except for Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, that one's not too good. But why does Indiana Jones have to be rebooted? Why, exactly? Those movies are so classic. Why? What was wrong with them? That's why, that's a lot of problems I have with mo some remakes that I actually saw the original movie to. Why do you have to remake them? They are, they're already good on their own, I didn't find any problems with them, and I looked it up on Rotten Tomatoes, that got a good percentage. Why are you remaking it? Like, for example, there was a movie called Judge Dredd with Sylvester Stallone in the 1990s, I think? I didn't see it, but a lot of people said that it was terrible. Then Dread 3D came out, which was a remake of that, and everyone said, after seeing the Dread 3D movie, that this is a pretty good remake, and this is actually a remake of a movie that should have been remade. You should be focusing more on remaking movies like Judge Dredd instead of Indiana Jones, any other movie that you have rebooted for really no reason. Remember The Amazing Spider-Man? You rebooted that. Yeah, I know, Spider-Man 3 didn't really turn out that good, but you had to reboot it. I, I know that was a deal with Sony and stuff, I don't care, you didn't have to reboot it, seriously. Oh, we had to retain the rights? Well, give it to Disney, please. It's much better. I've been hearing a lot of rumors and you've been debunking them, and I wish those rumors were true, because you're not doing a good job, Sony, with the Spider-Man. Just give it on over to Disney. So I like Chris Pratt as Indiana Jones. That's a pretty good idea, but my friend Nate actually suggested something that it would probably be good if it was like a prequel. Yeah, that would be pretty good, wouldn't it? Because then it wouldn't be a reboot. It'd be a prequel before, like, some adventures before. But no, it's a straight-up reboot. That's what it's gonna be. Chris Pratt, he's good. He's a great actor, and I think that's a good casting if they actually do go on with it, because Chris Pratt has the likability of Indiana Jones. But, reboot. Why? So what do you guys feel about the Indiana Jones reboot? I like Chris Pratt. Don't like the idea of it being rebooted. Leave it in the comments below. Also, Project Almanac comes out Thursday. And I'm probably going to go see that for some reason. So I'm going to have a really, really late review of Super Smash Bros. for the Wii U, finally. And I just started playing Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I don't know what's so special about those games, but it's okay. You'll find out more when I actually finish it. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. I'm Jackson Fulcher. See you guys next time. <laughs>